Hard work, that's what they say. Hard work, work. hard work, I earn my pay. Hard work, work, hard work, do it every day. Hard work, I work. get up about a quarter to three. Hard work, work. got to go and earn my pay. Hard work, work, put my boots on and lace them up. Hard work, work. Not hey, what's up, everybody? Work. Welcome back hard to Paint work. Boss. Hard I'm so sorry we haven't done a video say. lately, hard but we're out here shooting this massive house, so we thought we'd do a quick video of how we tackle a 2,000 square foot back patio paint grate soffit with hardy plank. So, and of course, the way we do this, you can see how massive and gorgeous this house is. This sits on the top of a mountain and it has views, endless, endless views. So what we're gonna show you today is how we use these extension wands to save our legs and to give the, and to give the client a better product. So what we're using today is a height extension pole. This is our shorter one, and our full one set up is like this. So we're gonna show you guys why it is that we use these. You can see this is a height extension pole, and I realize some parts of the world, you guys out there in Korea and Africa and out there in Australia, I'm not sure you guys can get these, but now with the internet, you guys can get everything. So you see, we just have our Graco gun right here, and we put it onto our pole, and this allows us two things. A, to save our legs, because you can imagine how long this would take trying to do with a ladder. But B, we can get right up on it. You see that? So we got a little bit of wind today. We're gonna get right up on the soffit, and we can shoot this whole thing at once. All right, so we're gonna take a little video of what that looks like, and we'll show you how to do it. Now you can see why we do that. It's massive leg savers, time savers, and it's actually a better finished product. Because if you can imagine us having to do square by square, we have a little bit of wind blowing, so we can get the we can get the gun and the tip right up on this soffit. This is hardy board, so there's no way to do, we're doing a pure white, there's no way to do that in one coat. So part of the reason we're showing you guys this is so you can get right up on that soffit. Now 
Now that I'm out there and I have the daylight basement, I'm going to push back to the way I was going. I'll put it a little bit up. Okay, so now that we got that done, you can see we have a little section. The cool thing about this is we keep it tensile, so I'm going to pull down the gun like that. Now I'm spraying it back to straight on the wall. You get this little adjustment right here, you can drop her down a little bit. And now since I'm here and my soffit's wet, I'm going to keep going and get this upper section. Another advantage to these is that when you guys know and you're at repaint, you always get to the top of those window sills and there's never any good amount of paint on it. So I'm just going to pull down on this handle. I can hit it at an angle. Now I can flip it upside down. Okay, so now that I got, so now that I'm back at, now that I'm back at eye level, you just untwist this little screw right here. It releases my gun, and boom, I'm in action. So you can see how long that takes and how much this saves us. So now I'm going to go vertically like this, and we'll finish up this whole section. This party board, so this is all cement fiber board. This stuff loves drinking paint. So you gotta go real heavy with it, give it a chance. Nice thing is though with that fishing pole, we can load her up. We never even need to step on a ladder. Other than the masking. So that's Really what we're all trying to do is get a good finished product and again the advantage of all of that is you're really up against this soffit. So I know like the homeowners and stuff you might want to buy it. These things are like a hundred bucks a high pull. But you can see as Jose's showing you. I mean this thing is so big I can't even imagine having to do that on the ladder. I mean you can see how much soffit work that is. I think we blew through maybe 30 gallons plus it's a windy day. So not only the advantage is saving all of our, you can see all that plastic blowing. So on a day like that, instead of calling the day off and you're not being able to spray, you get your high pull and I can get right up against the substrate we're spraying. So in this case, it was the soffit. So thank you guys so much for your support. I'm sorry it's been so long uh, since a video, but man, they do take a lot of time and we've been so busy. So we're gonna get better. We're gonna try to start posting once a week. All right, everybody. Thanks so much for coming along. Click that bell, get that notification, and thank you so much for all your support on YouTube. We really do appreciate it. The crew appreciates it. So I hope that helped everybody, and we'll see you soon.